Imagine finding a hiker frozen solid in the snow. Blue skin, no pulse, not breathing. You'd think they're dead, right? Wrong. That person might still be alive. Their heart beating so slowly you can't feel it. Their brain barely working. They are in a state of suspended animation. But if you try to save them, you could actually kill them. Here's the paradox. Severe hypothermia slows everything down. Your heart, your breathing, your brain, activity. It's like a self-induced coma to survive. People have survived for hours like this with no detectable pulse and recovered completely. But the moment you start warming them, everything changes! A cold heart is extremely fragile. The slightest disturbance, even gentle movement, or rewarming to fast can trigger sudden cardiac arrest. This is called afterdrop. As you warm someone, cold blood from their limbs rushes back to their core, shocking the heart and causing it to stop. They survive the freezing cold, only to die during the rescue. So rescuers face an impossible choice. Warm them fast and risk afterdrop, or warm them slow and risk brain damage. It's the hypothermic rescue paradox, where the act of saving someone could be what kills them. In our next episode, we dive into the science of suspended animation. Don't miss it.